this video presentation of the DM scientific slot decoder. We have made an excellent test bed for trials where you can try out a slot die head in a small environment and look what happens when you scale it up. So this small machine actually mimics all the processes you would find in one of our bigger slot die coding machines. The machine has a slot die coding bay with one slot die coding head. It's mounted on a Picatilly controlled head mount. That means that we can control the height, the tilt and the skew of the head from a touch screen. So no manual adjustments. You can repeat every trial very accurately by storing the parameters in the computer. Also the advance, the speed of the slot die head can be controlled digitally. And we have even connected the small syringe pump up here to the computer so we control the start and stop of the pump in correlation with the movement. So once the coating is done in the test area, the machine will move the coating into a hot air oven. So the hot air oven will then bake the material for a certain amount of time. You can control the temperature of the hot air oven. You can also control the temperature of the coating bed. There is a small temperature regulator up here, so we can even preheat the substrate. That is, if you have a thick substrate, like a glass plate, then you can put down a preheater here to heat the surface of the material. Now we have taped the material up because it's a thick glass plate. It could also be a thin film, and then we can utilize the built-in vacuum system in the machine, so we can enable a small vacuum that will suck the material down. Now we have prepared a small solution here, so we're going to uh, take the unit for a spin and do a small coating. And um, we'll start it up right now and then show you some video in detail of how that looks. So let's start the machine. Now the coating is completed, so now we're going to lift up the head and then drive the coating bed into the hot air oven. So now the uh, curing process is started, so we are closing the oven. And we can then program that the uh, coating is cured for a certain amount of time. I'm just going to close the oven enough here. So now we close the oven and we have driven the material into the oven. So we are going to cure it. If you want to know more, please contact us and do remember to press the subscribe button to see more videos like this.